Hi guys, so today I'm going to show you this shiny metallic look that's good on New Year's, but since it's nowhere near you New Year's, um, that it's good for pretty much any special occasion or any time you want to fancy it up. It's just a nice metallic silvery sparkly look. This is a UV top coat from Sally Hansen. I got this for around $2.50 maybe. Okay, so this is optional, but if you want a more elegant look, a more fancier look, and something not too intense, you can use this sheer French color. It came in the same package as the UV top coat, so it was also around like $2.50. Okay, so um, here I'm using LA Colors uh, Art Deco, and so this isn't just pure black. Uh, I got this from, from the 99 cent store, so it was only a dollar, and I think I have seen this in CVS, um, but it's pretty good quality for 99 cents, to be honest. This is a fine tipped nail polish. You're gonna need a fine tipped nail polish. That's why it's called Art Deco, because it, you know, art and decorates and your nails and stuff with little details. So yeah, you're gonna need a fine point uh, brush. Um, so that's how small it is in comparison to my nails um, in the clip. Okay, so this is very pro professional, but no, it is not. I got this also from the 99 cent store, um, ZNM nail polish look. It doesn't even have um, a color, but it's uh, metallic. It's a very metallic, uh, shiny, sparkly, um, silver color. So you're just gonna pretty much need that kind of base of color. And so it has to be pretty, it can't be transparent. It has to be a pretty solid color. And this uh, surprisingly is, that since this is also from the 99 cent store, it only cost it a dollar. And yes, um, cosmetics from the 99 cent store is harmful to your skin, but you need to make sure that your skin is not um, too sensitive. If it's not too sensitive, if your skin's not too sensitive, then um, this nail polish should be fine. So first you want to add in your top coat first as a base, or you can use a base coat obviously, but I already applied a base coat, so now I'm using my sheer French color, which is a light pink natural color like I showed you in the beginning, um, from Sally Hansen. And so, yeah, I'm just adding this. Um, like I said, this is optional, but if you are going to do this option or whatever, you're going to have to add thin coats by thin coat. Otherwise, it's just gonna be too transparent and look honestly horrible. So then, yeah, just remember, thin coat by thin coat, let it dry between each coat. Okay, so um, now what we're doing is we are um, getting some of that ZNM nail polish, and so this is the metallic silver nail polish from the 9 cent store, like I explained earlier. And so we're just going to run it diagonally across the top left or right corner of our nail, really depends on your uh, ch choice, your style of life or whatever. And so um, almost, just almost halfway, um, a quarter of um, pretty much halfway. After that dries, with the thin black nail polish, you're just going to make an outline of where you drew the um, metallic, the silver metallic. And then we're going to do um, one streak to the right, one streak to forward, to the um, in front or whatever, to up, and another streak to the left on the lower corner of your um, nail. And it has to be the opposite corner. So mine would be, um, my right corner so yeah so um so there you go uh there is the complete look and i really 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 hope you guys try this out it first comes
house it works, you can't do it because you don't have the right colors, well then, go ahead, feel free to do it on different colors if you wish, experiment, see how it would look like with neon colors, with plaid, maybe you can do a design on the metallic part, so yeah, really hope you guys try this out, thanks for watching, bye!